Hello, my name is Sridhar and I'm from India. In this video, I show how to set up Sox Proxy on a Mac using SSH dynamic port forwarding. First, open up System Preferences, go to Network, Advanced, Proxies, select Sox Proxy. Under Sox Proxy Server, type in localhost. Next to localhost, type in the port number. I chose 8020. It can be anything as long as it's not a privileged port. Click OK. Before hitting apply, let me create an encrypted tunnel to a trusted network through SSH dynamic port forwarding. SSH dynamic port forwarding is a way to opening a SOX proxy server on your local computer and forwarding all of the data to a SSH server on the internet. Now, open the application terminal Type the command ssh space dash capital D. There can be space or no space after D. And then type in the port number you put in the system preferences 8020. Then the username or username of the ac account you have on the remote host. Let's say the account name is reader at full and then it should be the fully qualified domain name. So let's say it is remote.edu, okay, remote.edu. Enter and then you will be prom prompted for a password. Once you are logged on to the other system, go back to the system preferences, hit apply. Then open either Safari or Google or Firefox and type in what is my IP address.com and you will see the IP address of your server rather than seeing an IP address of your local computer. As you can see, whatever you are requesting, it is coming through remote host. Then it will be channeled back to your local computer through, a, through the encrypted SSH tunnel. This means you are encrypting your web browsing session from your local computer.